construct comes with a cool revolution slider plugin. So in this video I'm going to show you how to create this 3D kind of effect you saw on the preview on ThemeForest. What you see here is a construct install where I imported the XML file. So if you're new to WordPress, new to Revolution Slider, you might just import the XML file which was provided with the um, download, um, the, this, the zip you downloaded from ThemeForest. All right, so let's take a look at the backend. First, you have to activate the Revolution Slider plugin. You can do that on your plugins page. Next, you will figure that there is a new Revolution Slider menu point in your backend. Over there, you find a button called Import Slider. This is very important because we use some specific settings for the Revolution Slider. So even if you are familiar with the Revolution Slider, please make sure to import the slider setup file which was provided in the zip folder that you downloaded from ThemeForest. Alright, after you've done so, you created the so-called Big 3D Slideshow. Now, let's take a look. If you click on Edit Slides, you can create slides. So there's one pre-created over here already. This slide actually contains two images. A big image at this position and another small image, which is basically the head which is, as you can see, on a transparent background. If you don't find these images in your slideshow, even though you imported the slider setup, you might, uh, you might just import the XML file as well, because they will contain these images. Alright, so as you can see, I just um, got those two images on the slideshow here. This is the perfect size for um, the theme. Uh, make sure that both are at the same time. They both appear at the same time, so put 5.5 five or 8.8 eight eight here. Make sure they don't appear at different um, times at the um, on the timeline. And update your slider. And that's basically it. You have a transparent um, slider on the front end. So um, to create such a slider is actually very easy. Um, you just go to Photoshop and there's also an example PSD within the zip file you download from ThemeForest it contains this PSD so you see that there's um, the top simply on a transparent background so save this part um, as a PNG and the other part here as a JPEG you can do that by simply um, going down here to the ruler and of course going up to the ruler again and choosing this one Alright, um, of course in the end what you have to do is you have to go to your Construct Theme Configuration panel and you actually have to activate the slider. So go on Enable Main Page Slider, yes, and choose the slider set, Big 3D. Save your changes and then you're good to go. So if you have any more questions, simply drop us a note in our support form. We are very happy to help and make sure that you are able to set up the page just the one the way you want. Alright, thank you.